and hello and welcome to VR the ML Echo Arena Season 2. We're going right in the action because these teams are just readying up right on three. Hey, yep. folks, remember to read the rules. Uh, but here we go. Cosmos <laughs> against Annihilators. I'm the one you see it alongside me is Retap Worm Hype Season Ayo. 4. Cycle 2 first match. Bronze versus Bronze. Woo! Unfortunately, it's a 3v4, uh, but it's an exciting one. Retap, how you feeling? I'm feeling good, man. New cycle, new start to this season. Oh, you know, you know what I'm saying? New start anyway. I'm excited to see how these guys are going to kick off the season for EU. As, uh, yeah, they have started anyway. They're excited. They want to start the season. They want to start it like, quick. And they want to get a goal. But that is a beautiful save to start off right there. Hey, first save of the season, of the hey, cycle, whatever. Uh, and it was a good one. Bulo taking that one all the way through for a lovely long clear. And can they get it? Is it going to go in? No, not quite. They can't recover it just yet. So instead, it's going to be bouncing back and going for another attack. They're going for another attack. Uh, I'm going to go set some side cam action for a second. I'm going to make sure that these teams are on the right sides. Uh, Loki, it's Lucid. They are? No, they're flipped, I think. There we go. So Cosmos is with three, right? Uh, uh, wait, I'm so can Yes, I think so. I think that's right now. All right, cool. We're getting there. A uh, Vera Milk 2. Gotta love it. No prediction. A uh, nice steal. Yeah, fantastic steals. Uh, but man, when I was talking to these teams beforehand, I mean, this is their first cast. So they're Woo! feeling good. It's they're they're excited, man. I mean, that's what you love to see. Uh, they know they have the teamwork Cosmos does to win or at least do well. Uh, so I mean, very excited for that. They're feeling nervous but confident. Low key, it's lucid. So. I'm excited to see these folks play, um, but this looks like it will be Annihilator's Day as they do dive in. Hit the post. No way. No. Double dings. No. Get it done. Get it done. All right. And they do. Oh, I've done that before. Trying to play cool for the cast. Go for that backboard <laughs> shot. And just ding away. Unfortunate. But hey, hey, they got that. They got there in the end. And that's what counts. These guys have come off to a nice strong start. 2-0 at the minute for Annihilators. As Disc is sent up field for the first joust for Cosmos now. It's looking good. It's gone all the way. It's bouncing back as they are there. Loki. Loki right by the goal, but no! Loki is stunned out by No Scope, who is no scoped. And they're gonna take that one back all the way for all the way through uh what a play man i mean yes it is bronze um all the uh, by the way whoever is in chat these teams are new first cast ever in eu so that's definitely very hype if you are just joining us um but uh here we go lucid moving up field bounce shot oh, no not quite fine in the back of the net but they will find the recovery uh, as they are going to look to put more points on this board. Low pass there. Uh, connecting up. Binginator over to Lucid. Oh, what a save! Bulo, Bolo. Wow. Yeah, wow indeed. These guys definitely showing what they can do right now. Bronze has evolved since Season 2. Exactly, Ooh. man. Absolutely. Look at these plays coming out. These guys are definitely way better than I was. Oh, that long shot. Oh, oh, nearly a perfect shot there. But still, no scopes that popes is, has that disc. A nice pass upfield. One and a shot. Cheaters. Oh, a beautiful attack right here. Annihilators definitely annihilating that defense with a beautiful cut and goal. 4 0. Yeah, 4 0. I mean, there's not much you can do with that one, but absolutely fantastic playing. Uh, Rolo was playing with me in a bronze team. Uh, hold on, I can't read in, in, in cam. Uh, bronze team or silver team ago. He's a good player. I don't think he's playing his best. Well, hey, you know what? He's had some sick saves. So even if he's not playing his bet, uh, Diot, uh, he's absolutely cracked. But that's a cut pass. Not going to work because it is stunned. Uh, but it is going to be Bolo trying to get through. Not quite finding it. So it is going to be Lucid getting it not quite through either. Unfavorable bounces as a scramble for the disc in the neutral zone. It is, in fact, a 3v4. Yeah, I'm not quite sure why. They did choose to beforehand. They knew that they were beforehand. I think Luke said, uh, you can do it in a 3v4. And they were like, yeah, yeah, probably. So, uh, oh, a long shot coming in there. Nice three points. That was a beautiful one. That was 30 meters. Killer. Definitely can't leave those goals open. These guys are going to hit you. But yeah, guys, if you're watching this and you didn't know, get league subs. 
Big subs are great. They're there for a reason. They want to play. They want to join your team. They want to be the ones to help bring it to a 4v4. So definitely worth doing next time if you can. And uh, always fun to play with new players as well as the Galaxy plays gets to stun out. That needed a little bit of uh, warning maybe from their teammates, but regardless, they do have a pass coming anyway. A recovery and a clear all the way upfield. Right into the Cosmos side. A charge now. The goal is open, but Biulo is there first to take it back. But no! Recovery again for Galaxy. Galaxy stunned out by Biulo, and Biulo takes it back again. No goals for you this time, they say. They want the goals for Cosmos. And they want the goals for Cosmos. Still not broken the silence yet. 3v4, I mean, it's what happens sometimes. But hey, I mean, the first couple matches of Season 4 that were casted long. 3 meters. points! Galaxy Blaze, Galaxy Brain, Galaxy Aim. 10-0. Ten zero. Oh, okay. We're only uh, six minutes in, but ten zero is a beautiful start for them. And definitely a strong start. So definitely need to watch out for Cosmos. That could be moving against them right now. Hey, it's Palace in the chat. Hey, Palace. Good to see you there. Was that little? Uh, was that a face plant? I can't even see it right now. As these guys have the disc back again. Oh, a shot is all the way forward, bouncing back. Not going in just yet, but they have recovered it. They take the shot and the ding. They take that ding instead of getting the goal. They're all going to charge it down. Bing gets it first, but Bing loses it first. Put no scope the poke. Taking that one up forward, bouncing up close to the goal. This is dangerous in the danger zone and no goalie to stop it. And they're taking oh. shots. Oh, what a save that is through the goal. And save against the other side. They have recovered it again, but Annihilators have been pushed back this time. And they have been pushed back. I mean, Cosmos, it's a 3v4. It's unfortunate. But what's fortunate is the amount of saves that Cosmos has. I mean, their defense is fantastic. As there's another read from Bolo on the backside. As that's going to get cleared all the way through. And are the stacks going to be there for Orange? Because Blue misread them. Unfortunately not. As they do get broken up uh, in the midfield. As that's turned right back the other way. Yeah, right back the other way. But no, they have it again. Yes, they do. This could be it. The first goal. No. No scope. The Pope doesn't need a scope to see that disc and take it back for a steal. As Lucid is going to walk it up. Oh, accidentally throw it into that block right next to them. A little spin, but still recovered and sent back forward once again. And now here they are. Lucid, a shot and goal. And Lucid gets it done. A lovely long three pointer. That is going to be good for them. That's going to give them another three pointer. And now they're 13 to 0. Yeah, 13 to 0. I mean, what a shot. What an angle. Barely missed post as Wintry Ice. How's it going, my man? Welcome to Cycle 2. Hopefully, you have some exciting matchups this week. Always a pleasure to see you, but it's a long clear. Let's see if Cosmos can break that silence, break that ice. But no, Lucid says, hey, that might be nice if we mercy. They want to no rest for the Wicked, and that's going to bounce around. They're only it's nine points away. Uh, I don't know math. Seven points away, but there's a long three. And that, you, of meters. course, you hit those. Binginator, oh my goodness. Oh, a nice long one there. Four points to go until that mercy. And one minute 45. They've really got to be careful right now because, you know, that, that is going to be knocking at the door. The mercy win is coming to them unless they can stop it. So... Bulo takes that one. No, the stun comes out, but they're able to get the disc away. Uh -oh. Not cleared. Accidentally bounced back off that block and sent back there into their own side. There's Binganator. Binganator trying to find the Parsonator, but they can't just yet. Instead, they're going to duke around, take their time, get up close, get even closer, duke around both those players, and take the shot, but take the ding instead. No. Lucid just misses it as well. No skip the Pope. Doesn't need a scope for this shot. Oh, they don't at all. It's a beautiful bounce shot. And now they're just two away and one minute to go. What a play. I mean, Annihilator's absolutely doing great. Uh, Mercy wins happen in Vermeer matches. Sampi, uh, or Sampai. Uh, yeah, it's 20-0 as people are saying. But it could be a 20-point differential. So it can be as the timeout does come through. Um, Maybe someone didn't realize they had a timeout because both teams went out of the tube. Anyway, uh, but tw 20 diff point differential. So it could be 40 to 20, for instance, and that could still be a mercy win. Um, just Yee. a 20 point lead in general. Uh, that's a lot. It depends. I thought it was 24. Uh, no, it's not 24. Um, if you have four points, then you have to reach 24. But uh, yeah, it is just that 20 point, whatever it is. 
Ooh. But yeah, I mean, we have, we have a pause, right? Definitely good to use those pauses when you need them. Uh, not sure why they've paused just here. Oh, is that another player? What? Hello? Whoa. A league sub? Yeah, hello? Or maybe one of their own players? Wait, let me check this. Is this one of the... Oh, no, they've changed. Oh, uh, that was so ooh, hype. Shout out to the league subs, ooh. man. I mean, when yeah. I was talking to Annihilators, I mean... Biginator is feeling confident, you know, they're, 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 when going into this match, they're excited and also nervous uh, since uh, he did get a second shot today uh, and his left arm isn't doing so well. But he's hoping for uh, it doesn't affect his performance. I mean, we saw some amazing shots from Biginator. Um, you know, he's excited to be able to participate in the match and, and excited to be casted. So, I mean, much love to Biginator, much love to all these teams. But, I mean, the league subsystem is also there for everyone to use regardless of level so uh use it as a use as it. A side note as well just uh you know definitely know when you can use your league subs know all your rules because the rules are very important definitely know your rules as well about uh spectators in games uh when you're being casted is a bit of a no-go just so we can make sure we can get all our you know crew in if we need them all our cast and crew but you know you know it happens it happens easy players I'll get there. But yeah, just know your rules, because the rules are there. They're good, they're useful, and they can help a lot with these kind of things. Knowing your pauses, knowing when to get those players in, and when not to have uh, five players in the arena, but they are going to be working it back now. They're down uh -oh. to two players. Uh-oh. They not changed teams their... accidentally. Bolo, oh, go back. Teams. Oh, no. Bolo, go back, but he doesn't oh. need it. No! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Almost a three. Almost a three, unfortunate. Uh, but there's an opportunity there from Cosmo showing some signs of life, but... They just need two points. Uh, a dunk is, is all they need. It would be the ice, but it is going to be a banged back and forth off the ceiling. Bounce pass uh, to Lucid. 9.4 meters. Who gets a three just because. 21 0. Annihilators oh. dominated this one. Was that was that time or mercy? That was mercy. I thought that was time. Was it both? Uh, I, thought, I, I want to think it was both at the same time. <laughs> I thought it was. Uh, regardless, yeah, a, a very, very strong round for that first one. Four Annihilators, absolutely annihilating the competition there. And maybe, just maybe, oh, oh, we are now seeing, uh, there is, there's only one player left on orange right now. So, I'm sure they'll figure it out. I'm sure they'll oh, figure they'll it, it out. I'll work it out, yeah. Uh, but but hey, yeah, maybe I mean, get a leaks up. Get a leaks up, maybe. Uh, regardless, uh, no, they're not going to lose because of that, um, uh, Paddish, because, um, it's 30 seconds. The rule is 30 seconds if they accidentally team switch. And if they don't enter the arena, it's fine. Um, that's the... Uh, is it? Uh, yeah. It, like, if you accidentally do it and you don't move and you just, like, team switch back, it's fine. Um, um, but that's, like, that's grace period. It's obviously don't... If you're abusing it, then, you know, that's the rule. But again, read the rules. Understand, you know, they change, they update, they, you know, whatever. Read them. Know what's going on. Know what you can do. Know what you can't do. Also, how's it going, Torque? I hope you're doing well. Uh, yeah, no suit and tie today. Uh, just a t-shirt. Uh, in fact, uh, if I'm being really honest with you, this is my undershirt from yesterday. Uh, so, uh, but, uh, you know, we're having a good time. They didn't leave the lobby. Exactly. Um, well, no, I don't know, Paddish. I mean, I don't remember the situation. But um, regardless, it looks like we might have a 4 before. That is what we might have. That would be so dope. That's what I would. That's be oh. super, super dope. Uh, Walter. Walter's new. Is Walter part of the team? Walter yes. is not new. He was in the oh. arena the entire time, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. Damn it. All right. Oh, it's boss. boss. No, is boss new. Boss is new. No, no. Boss. Boss was on blue. Boss no. is a annihilator player. Well, he he was the guy who was on there on fire. He's annihilator anyway. Oh. Um. Unfortunately. Okay. Unfortunately, yo, 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 yeah, it's a hex 2906. How's it going, man? Sorry, I cut you hex? off. Going. Yo, man, hex. How's it going, man? Um, but yeah, I do have I do have the rule here. I have consulted the ancient gods, <laughs> and, and Luke's right. Uh, I've consulted the ancient texts cast down to me from the, the those who be the powers that be. And yes, actually, I didn't know this from a time when the matches begins till it ends, at no point is there five members on one team while clock is running. But when it's paused, teams may have up to five players for up to 30 seconds. So yeah. you should, when you need a substitution, make one player leave and then get them in. But if you can't do that, for up to 30 seconds, you can have five players in. Um, still, obviously, remember your, you know, your, your, your 
spectator rules. Make sure you get no spectators when you're being casted, just so we can get all our casting crew in. But the fire players thing, don't get to know. I didn't know that. I thought it was no time at all. So that, that's that's useful. Because yeah. I always, always switch over to the wrong team as well by accident. Um, <laughs> yeah. Like I so often do that. When you hit, when you hit unspectate, you never, you don't, you can't control it, can you? True. As far as I understand, it was man. just random. It's just like you know, it puts you on orange or blue probably consistently, but I don't know. I don't know, but I think it's the last team you were on. I think that's it. Uh... Uh, but even so, I mean, if your team's full or like, sometimes you invite someone, right? I, I invite people to sub in for us, and then we'll start the game, and then they might join, and you're like, whoa, 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 whoa. get out, get out, no, 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 we're playing. <laughs> get out of here, kid. <laughs> so yeah, just good to know your rules, because I didn't actually know that. Yeah, it always um, is great to rule, learn the rules. I mean, make sure you rules. read them. I mean, shout out to all the mods, board directors, all that they do behind the scenes. But, I mean, mm. as much as I love all that they do behind the scenes, I would love for them to do less behind the scenes if everybody True. understood the rules. And everybody kind of stayed up to date. There's the rules posted uh, in the chat right now. Uh, so make sure you check them out. It's not just for fun. Uh, you know, it's uh, it's it's uh, you can become the number one team. If you know the rules, that's all you need to do. Just learn the rules, maybe number one. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. But here we go, neutral joust round two. Uh, let's see what Cosmic, if they can come back. Cosmos, rather, can do and uh, get a round three. Let's see. But Annihilators will uh, happily take that neutral joust. Yeah, take it up to the goal. Oh, next to it, but the sun comes out. Loki is all he needs. Doesn't need to be high key for that one. He just needs to be low key enough to get that stun, get that disc, and get it out, but not quite yet, unfortunately. A little bit of a too low key clear, as they are going to get it back again. But again, Galaxy plays with the Galaxy brain back there. They're able to predict where that's going and get it intercepted back again by Cosmos. A lot of space theme in this game as these guys are working up. Loki up to there to Bu oh. Bulo, no! Bulo is, just gets stolen off them. That the shot doesn't quite work out. They need a goal on the board to help get some momentum. Unfortunate. Yeah, super unfortunate, but they are going to get pressured here. Uh, so there's going to be a nice long pass to the ceiling. Ducking around. Holy stun. And two on the board. Annihilator started off 2-0. Yeah, 2 0. Oh, definitely at the start that they want. But Cosmos, they have time. They have like nearly nine minutes. If you are getting goals at full speed and playing a perfect game, that is. Luke, how many goals is it? Uh, 54 what? points. 54 points in yeah. nine minutes. Yeah, <laughs> you can. You can score a lot of points. I mean, is it possible? Yes. Is it likely? Yes. No. But no, but yeah, you know, play a perfect game. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. If you play a perfect game, oh, you can get it done. Oh, oh, nice oh. Shot. Annihilators are definitely playing a perfect oh. game right now. Look at these two pointers. They're killing it. They're absolutely killing it. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my. I this that just makes me so happy to see. Like, I don't. I I mean, four v three. Yeah, big sad. But like, the fact that they're still killing it, even four v three. Oh. But there's the stuns, and uh, that can be an open three. Yes, it 11. will. 11.6 meters. Oh my goodness, that wasn't a nasty shot. Nice play, but man, seven, seven, oh. Seven, no, yeah, it's definitely a good start for Annihilators. Want to keep that momentum moving, as they are going to be waiting for their joust. Cosmos have another chance here to work this one back to work out what they're doing. As they're going to just be in tunnel. <laughs> <laughs> through the chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah <laughs> I did too. Just, just ignore it. Just ignore it. Guys <laughs> working it up. Taking it back right here. Trying to get it through. Come on, Cosmos. You can do it. I believe in these guys. It's got to root for the underdog sometimes. These guys low key up by the goal. One oh, on one. And they get it in. Woo! They did it. Woo! Cosmos getting it done. Getting that shot and getting themselves on the board for the first time in this game. Good start. The start of a comeback. Reverse sweep. Reverse yeah, sweep. you know what? This is the beginning of the story for them, right? This is their first cast ever. They wanted 3v4 to to, to uh, uh, balance themselves because they're just too goaded. As they are going to be uh, turning right back around. The first neutral, the uh, first just advantage uh, from Annihilators. Uh, but that's, their, I mean, some great pressure here coming from Cosmos. They almost could read this disc. Unfortunately, uh, they didn't. Uh, but there's a cut pass. And, uh, 2. 6 two meters. Right Unlucky, oh! but 9-2 Annihilators. 9-2 Annihilators is definitely a good start to this. My god, these guys are absolutely killing it. 
for a bronze team, you know? Got to imagine what they're going to be doing next. They got to be climbing up. I believe in these guys. I, mean, I remember when I was bronze, right? I was like terrible. I was like a cat pass, a cat who? Uh, so like who's yeah, cat? these guys here, like honestly, both teams are doing an amazing job right now. It's honestly so good to see how good everyone's gotten at this game, especially at the start of this new cycle, cycle two of season four. As these guys are chasing it down, Cosmos are there. They have that disc, but no, the stun comes out. Can they recover it in time? No, Lucid, a beautiful steal there from three different players, getting it out to no scopes to Pope. No scope that Pope is going to pass that one back there. Nice little reset to Galaxy. Galaxy looking for the cut, but no! Oh, Bulo dives in and steals it straight back again. And straight back again. Not quite bouncing in, but do they read that? Oh, unfortunately not. Stack did break apart, so a little bit slow to recover, but that's an opportunity there. Fortunately, still not together, but Binginator looking for a low clear. Broke up with his teammate, but that might slap in. Uh, that will get put in, but the save! Oh my goodness, Bulo! Absolutely insane. That's going to get cleared all the way downfield, but not picked up by his teammates. Instead, it will get turned around by Galaxy Played, but he's, I think he's been the one who were consistently hitting Geo spot on. Unfortunate, unlucky. Uh, but now uh, that will be a kind of pass out. Uh, at least our scramble for this disc, but it will get one. Actually, by Loki, it's Lucid who gets it downfield. Do they find the bounce in? No. Do they find the disc first? Yes. Do they find the two? No, unfortunately not. Not quite the bounce they were looking for as that does get back into the neutral zone and cleared out. Yeah, cleared out, cleared up, cleared into the cosmos. Is it all the way in that bubble? Can they get there in time? No, they can't. It's Annihilators who are there first. They have the disc. They're working it up. He's spinning. Oh, and he slams it in. A bing, bang, and a bong to bring that one up for another two points. Nine point lead now. Killing it. It's Annihilators. That yeah, certainly will uh, be a fun, fun week and a fun, fun day. And this is just the beginning. Cycle 2, Season 4 is certainly here to stay for another five more weeks of fun. As uh, Bo Bulo is going downfield. All the way downfield. It's a race. Oh, but they don't win it, unfortunately. I mean, they do, but they just don't get the disc. As it is going to get picked up by Lucid Longshot. Ooh. Not quite the angle they were looking for, probably, but bouncing around. Bouncing through. Will he get picked up by Binginator? Yes. Will he be moving around, trying to get two? Yeah, back pass. Oh, meters. what a play. 13-2 Annihilators. 13-2 is a strong lead. Damn, these guys trying to get that Mercy win again. Can they do it? Can they get there in time? I don't know if they have the time. And honestly, Cosmos are looking like they're warming up into this game. They want to really show what they can do here. Maybe there's not time enough for them to come back. But there is enough time for them to really, really do some more of those good moves we've been seeing. And it's going to go, unfortunately, straight cleared into those hands of Blue. Unfortunate that Cosmos still only have three players. They could definitely benefit from that fourth. As Hey, Summer, how's it going? Fancy seeing you here. Um, as it is going to be Lucid taking that one out. Not far out enough, though, unfortunately. So instead, it is going to be cleared back up there into Loki Lucid's hands. Cleared back there to Bulo. Bulo ducking, diving, weaving, jumping, oh shooting, and scoring that one in. A lovely solo play from a beautiful pass from their teammate. Definitely making this work with only three players. Cosmos getting it done. Yeah, fantastic job from Cosmos getting four points. Hey, that's four times as many. That's an infinite times as many points as they did in round one. Uh, Ooh, but uh, uh, there we go. Binginator picking it up. Trying to move it down. Not quite connecting, uh, but it is going to bounce around. Bounce in. No, not quite. Uh, but it will bounce in the hands of Bulo. He's liking. That's a good clear. Is the stack there? Ugh, no, the stack's unfortunately... Got stunned. I mean, fantastic job by uh, No Scopes the Pope for stack for stunning the stacks. But it's again a two v a two v no a two v three is not going to get done as that is going to bounce not quite out but back into the neutral zone and picked up uh, by Lucid. Yeah, picked up by Lucid, cleared out all the way. Three oh three my meters. God! What a beautiful pass that was. I'm going to say absolutely that was not a shot. That was a pass and it was good. A beautiful one, perfectly lining up. Galaxy Kiblai is there for a long cut. Getting it done. And now 11 point lead. One minute 30 to go. Definitely feeling strong. 
are definitely oh. feeling strong, but they're too slow. 6.5 meters. And just like that, suddenly it's 17-4. Man, I mean, oh. Annihilators, I mean, they're just doing everything but, right, man. I, I really enjoyed that play so much for the cut that I bit my tongue when I saw it. I'm, I'm bleeding. Oh, <laughs> I did no. It. Congrats, guys. Your play was so good, it made me bleed. Um, no. You know what? That's what you want to see. That's what you want to do. You want to do these really good plays. And that's that's a good sign of a good play. So congrats, guys. Proud of you. Be proud of that one. It was a lovely cut. And those are the kind of cuts that you want to do at these kind of levels to be really, really getting those improvements. Working up. Get silver. Get silver. You know, get gold. Get black. Oh. Get diamond. Get masters. Six get the gold. Oh. Masters. Get it. Get done with the goalies. Done. Getting the dub and getting that point. Another two points on, on the board. Definitely looking really strong. Hold on. You missed oh, the double dusty. He double dustied. Did he? And then he got the goalie. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, beautiful. A, a dusty for like what a play. I mean, I mean, man, these players on Cosmos are absolutely insane. Again, get a league sub. These players are so good in the arenas. There's an open three and they hit those. Meters. Oh my goodness! Galaxy plays Galaxy aim, as I've said before. Uh, but now uh, that is the game. As, that uh, is the game. But man, I mean, what a what a game! You, know what I mean? you win some, you lose some, but like, oh, some um, fantastic plays when they did have the opportunities from Cosmos. Huge shout out to them. Uh, but I mean, oh, I mean, you yeah. know, Annihilators. They they did what they should have done, which is win this in two rounds. So I mean, GGS. But wow. <laughs> Summer says, "Is there a bot that says the exact shot distance after someone scores?" You know what? If only, if only, if only there was a bot that good. Um, well, anyway, have you ever heard of Spark, guys? <laughs> Let me tell you about Spark. <laughs> Spark will do that, right? It will do that, won't it? I'm not, I'm not lying. Yeah, it will do that. It does. It, says it, it does like, that. Spark does do Spark that. Spark does well, so much, man. Come if you asked. Spark does everything. So Spark, go to exparvr.gg, ignitevr.gg slash Spark. And you can download Spark for yourself, and it will tell you in your ear uh, how far the shot goal was, how far yep. the joust was. Yeah. It will show you the scores, yep. who scored them, yep. who paused, yep. who got the stuns, yep. who got everything in the game. Yep. You can it see will, the scores it will even, afterwards if you forget. It yep. will even auto clip your highlights, auto clip your goals, auto clip your oh, saves, it will. auto clip your it will. your yeah. It will it will auto, it can auto clip. It can record your replays so you can analyze it with your team later. It can do so, so, so much, but use it. And more importantly, it can be an increase of quality of life for us in VRML if we have every team using Spark. If you're on Quest, you're like, my team's all Questies. We're all new. That's okay. Buy a CV1. No, I'm kidding. Uh, but uh, uh, there is a mobile <laughs> app. There is a mobile app. There is. Spark Beta. Go to the uh, Ignite Discord, ignitevr.gg forward slash spark, click the Discord link, get the beta roll, and you can download the beta app either in the Play Store straight through if you're Android, or you have to uh, get it through Test Flight if you're on Apple. Um, if you're unfamiliar with what Test Flight is, no problem. All the instructions, very simple, literally two steps. Download Test Flight, then click the link in the Spark in the Ignite Discord, and you can download the Spark beta. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Um, so uh, yeah, but huge shout out to ignitevr.gg and the Spark application uh, for all our... Um, stream statistics and you know for all that spark and the team does yeah much love to franz um you know franz is absolutely uh the bestest and always here to support so much love to them and also much love to Thank all you. our sponsors Ooh. you know hyper x hysterian products pro Tube vr rebuff reality vr cover and vr aware.net but most importantly uh, shout out to all you folks in chat i mean seriously it wouldn't be the same uh, without all of you supporting and uh, being part of the echo arena and vrml community and if you are new Hey, you're like, what's this crazy game? What's going on? What are these people talking about? Download the game. Go to the store, Echo VR. You know, it's, we're a welcoming bunch. Make it to the VML team. Find some friends. Make some friends. Maybe don't make any friends. Do what you want. Live your life. Uh, but if you want to join us, make some friends. Join a team and uh, have a good time. That's what we all did. And now we're here having a good time together. But that's it for us. Uh, first game, Cycle 2, Season 4 uh, in the go. EU. So, uh, yeah, congratulations uh, to Annihilators. This is just the beginning for them, and congratulations for that. Also, we are uh, accepting applications for the production team. Spark is linked in the chat. Yes. Um, apply. Retip and I run the onboarding systems. We're friendly. We don't bite. Uh, and uh, we'd love to have you he join does. the fight against uh, giving the people what they want. 
or no wick for giving people what Wait, they want. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? <laughs> yeah I, I did that backwards. Whatever. Uh, you know, and casting more matches. Where hey, you can join the creator team as well. Uh, regardless, feel free to do so. Uh, uh, VR at vrmasterleague.com forward slash echo arena uh, forward slash uh, register forward slash uh, production. Um, so make sure you join there or something like that. If you go to register, it'll be under there uh, on the uh, on the page. But that is it all. That is it all. That is all for us right now, right here. Day one. I'm the one you see. And alongside me is Retap Worm. Hey, the OG EU caster man. Uh, but uh, okay. there you go, doing the dance, doing the dance. But anyway, that's <laughs> it. I hope you have a great rest of your day, folks. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Season 4 of VRML Echo Arena is brought to you by HyperX Asterian Products VRWare Rebuff Reality VR Cover and Pro2VR <laughs>